Well, it's bad lighting in here, so let me turn on the light. Okay, guys? You don't gotta narrate the whole thing. Okay. I'm walking over. Walking over. Boop. I flicked it on. So, let's get back into this. What is up, my knockers? We're going to talk about the playoff games. Your knockers? You talking about your boobs? Nah, I said knockers, man. <laughs> What's up, boobs? <laughs> so we're going to be talking about the pregame today for the playoffs. So let's get into it for the Rams and the Falcons. How good is Julio? Well first, let's see... Well, who do you think would win? Let me know in the comments down below. I think it might be Atlanta, but I want to see LA have it. So how good is Julio? Julio Jones averaged 3.8 yards per root run. Best in the NFL. Yeah, so he's pretty good. So, big time... RBs. Devontae Freeman and Todd Gurley are the only NFL players with 3,000 plus rush yards. Rush yards. And 30 plus touchdowns over the last three seasons. The X factor on defense. Falcons linebacker Deion Jones received an 89.6 regular season grade from Pro Football Focus. Matt Ryan in playoffs. Well, last year, everyone knows they made the Super Bowl against New England, but New England's the best team, and they came back and won. Under the radar star. Well, that's all trash. But the last three games, well, the last game the Falcons won, 42-14, to 14, that was in 2016. This is a new year, everyone. New year. That was two years ago. Let's talk about the Rams now, guys. Next gen stat. Todd Gurley is an amazing running back. 15 miles per hour. Yeah. Top notch. The king of QB pressure. Aaron Donald. He is a beast, isn't he, guys? Aaron Donald. Light it up. Cooper Cup. He's good. And Jared Goff's okay, but not the greatest. Yep, and that's it for this matchup. Now, Tennessee and Kansas City. Which is going on in four. That's why I decided to record now. So, I have a feeling that Kansas City is going to beat Tennessee because Tennessee's not strong. Mr. Play Action. Marcus Mariota is the highest rated passer. But that's not true. Tom Brady is. Not as good without play action. On the play action passes, Mariota posted 6.9 passer rating during the 2017 season. Mariota is good under pressure. The defense has allowed 42.1. The MVP is Kevin Bayard, baby. Bayard. And, yeah, that's for the Titans. By the way, if you haven't seen it, it was rough week one, Patriots, because Kareem lit it up, but then he just slowed down. And Marcus Peters on a roll. And, yep, in the last game, the Titans have won, but that was two years ago. Again, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Sell them. Now, Buffalo at Jacksonville. Another interesting one. So the Bills. Tyrod. He has a lot of time. We need to pressure him. Lockdown corners. Per yeah. They have some good corners. 
Yes, they need, they're lacking throwing. Tyrod is pressured, dropbacks. Nice pressure against Buffalo, because if you know, if you're a Patriots fan, the Bills and the Jets are rivals of the Patriots really bad, but the Jets aren't even in the playoffs this year, so. Pass rushing for the Jags. Yannick Nagalko. Good. Pass blockers is Jeremy Parnell. Missing the home run ball. Blake Bortles. He has not done good passing this year. His team still made playoffs, but this is the only the wild card round. AJ Boy finished first in the NFL passer rating coverage. Linebacker Miles J. Jack and Paul Pulzini, he's done good. Yeah. Now moving on to Carolina and New Orleans. The Panthers have heavy defense with Luke Keekley. He only missed one tackle. And Christian McCaffrey, pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, the Carolina has had a rough year against the Saints, but it's a setback for the Saints because they lost Brandon Cooks. Now the Saints. Moving on. Saints rookie running back Alvin Kamar led the NFL per carry. Don't blitz. Go to guy with... That's open because Breeze passes it into too much double coverage. The partner's defense. Yep. Saints. Defensive end Cameron Jordan tied. So thanks for sticking with me. It was okay talking about it. I'll do it until the. I'll take a break at the Pro Bowl week because that's, like, just a chill week. But, I mean, I'll still record other videos that week, just not for the football. And even though I'm not friends with him because he's famous, Tanner Fox, go check out T Fox merch online. Search it in now. Hit the bell icon and subscribe. And see all you mockers later. Bye-bye.